says the Lord Almighty. Remember the law of my servant Moses, the decrees and laws I gave him at Horeb for all Israel. See, I will send the prophet Elijah to you before that great and dreadful day of the Lord comes. He will turn, turn the, the hearts, hearts of the fathers to the, the children, and the hearts children. of the children to their fathers, or else lest I come and strike I the earth come with a curse, and strike the land with total destruction. Second Chronicles 36, verse 16 But they mocked the messengers of God, and despised his words, and misused his prophets, until the wrath of the Lord Yahweh arose against his people, till there was no remedy. Beloved prayer intercessors, please listen. This is for all those who consider a mighty wind ministry a blessing, and Elizabeth Elijah a true prophet. You have written to let us know how much a mighty wind ministry has been a blessing to you. You have asked, what can you do to be a blessing in return? A mighty wind ministry is under attack by a satanic network over the internet disguised as Christians. They have the spirit of lawlessness and will lead souls to the Antichrist, who will come in the name Jesus Christ, and already lead souls to the spirit of Antichrist and the Jesus they claim is a dark Jesus. I am asking every one of you to post this prayer on your channels and websites if you stand in agreement with it. However, let's see how many of the enemies are willing to say this prayer, send it to others, or even post it on their channels. I have no doubt I and those in this ministry will be left standing as Elijah of old was left standing on Mount Carmel. Yeah, you say I am your Elijah of new. This is the prayer I feel led to ask you and it includes every enemy and every false witness. Unless they quickly apologize and write me saying, Elizabeth, don't say that prayer of Elijah of old because I know you are a true prophet and there is power in your words. I know there is power of life and death blessings or curses in the tongue of a prophet when Yah speaks forth. See now that I, even I, am He. There is no God with me, I kill, I make alive, I wound, I heal, neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. Rejoice, O ye nations, with his people, for he will avenge the blood of his servants, will render vengeance to his adversaries, will be merciful unto his land, to his people. The Lord of hosts will do battle for us. Behold his mighty hand. My prayer is, I ask you, Abba Yahweh, in the name of Yusha Hamashiach, judge now. Let your rage, your fiery wrath consume whoever are your true enemies. Consume whoever is leading souls to a false Jesus, another Lord, so all will know who is of you and who is of Satan. As in the time of Elijah of old, the prophets of Baal served Satan, and you vindicated Elijah of old. If I am a false prophet, I would rather die than continue to lead souls astray. However, if the enemies of a mighty wind who slander falsely accuse me, including bear false witness, are leading souls astray, they should also be willing to say this prayer. They should also be willing to die for leading souls astray, for calling a mighty wind a work of Satan, and for calling me a false prophet.
For over 25 years I have faithfully served you, bringing souls to you, Shahamashik, and living holy, striving to obey you in all ways. For over 15 years we have brought tens of thousands of souls to you, Shua, and we continue to do so. These enemies seek the destruction of this ministry. So Yahweh, let your real enemy be judged now, whether it be them or me. Judge now between them and the Mighty Wind Ministry. Show who is really glorifying you, Shohamashik, Jesus Christ. Now be Yahweh, these enemies weary me. I am fed up with the slanders, lies, libel, defamation of character, false accusations, false witnesses. I am fed up. Another innocent man has become their newest target only because he loves us. He felt rejected and made a video against a mighty wind, but he apologized and we love him. Please protect him, Abu Yahweh. For years I have been his pastor and covered him in prayer and tears. I pray, Yahweh, judge now between the enemies of a mighty wind ministry and me, the pastor prophet. Yah, quickly doom the liars. Judge now, Abba Yahweh, and do not delay. The Holy Spirit is fed up. Remember, this can only go on so long, and I pray that quickly. We shall see Yahweh's judgment come forth with his own hands, and that evil website will be destroyed, because the man who put it up will be destroyed by Yahweh's own hand, along with the false witnesses, all those that promoted that evil site, and all those who slandered a mighty wind, my name, and Yah's servant's name. We pray those who remain silent and did not defend us will be blessed by severe chastisement. Otherwise, it will prove Yah does not love them, because, as the Bible says, Yahweh chastises those he loves. Abi Yahweh, in the name of you, HaMashiach, please we send Archangel Michael, as you have sent him, to Elizabeth, Sherry, Elijah, and Nicomiah in the times of crisis to come and fight the bride of Satan, who have risen up against us in mockery and slanderous lies and sent forth their evil attacks on various levels. Please send Michael to battle against the hordes of hell that have come, that have come against us, trying to silence or kill Apostle, a Prophet, Elizabeth, Elijah with witchcraft, voodoo, hoodoo, Satanism, shamanism, sorcery, Kabbalah, and all other forms of occult. Please take vengeance on those that seek this ministry's destruction. Thank you, Father Yahweh, for defending all who are ministering from the Mighty One Ministries with videos exposing the lies of the evil ones, leading souls to you, Shohan HaMashiach, and mentoring the people. Please protect all leaders in the ministry, including Elizabeth Elijah and her husband as well, and every holy person who is defending our Mighty Wind, also all Mighty Wind Ministries, and rebuking the enemy's lies and standing with us, even if we do not know them personally. <clears throat> Thank you for sending the bride of Yahushua HaMashiach to YouTube and the ministry so they can help us expose the servants of Satan, children of the darkness that dare to use the word Christian to deceive the people and confuse them. We are honored to serve the Holy Trinity, the Aleph and the Tav, the Alpha and the Omega, and that is who this ministry is named after. All praise, honor, and glory goes unto Abi Yahweh, Yahushua HaMashiach, and the Ruach HaKodesh, Holy Spirit. In Yahushua HaMashiach's name I pray. Amen.